All right, we got a very cool dish here in Cook's Corner today. We also have a very cool beard. You got to check this thing out. Uh, we're joined by Douglas Breed of Red Fox Farm in Gilmanton. I love this, like Julian Edelman right here. Yeah, <laughs> wonderful. So, what are we making today? Today, we have cured smoked salmon, which is classically prepared with chopped red onions and capers and cream cheese. And to that, we're going to add our dilly garlic scapes, which okay. is a specialty that we, that we make. It's a specialty pickle. So, what but is a scape? A scape is the flowering portion of the garlic. Okay. It comes out in June, has a little seed pod on the end. It shoots up really quick. And then, um, as farmers, you cut that off right away because you want the growth to go to the bulb underground. Okay. If it was c allowed to continue to grow, it would get a big seed pod and that would go to the ground and it would replant itself like that. that. Okay. So we take the scapes and we um, and we stuff them in jars. We called it bro we call it broken slinky in a jar, and um, <laughs> and then can them just like dilly beans. If anybody's familiar with that. And we discovered that it is a perfect accompaniment to cured smoked salmon. Oh, that's wonderful, right there. And okay. um, and with the onions and capers and on rice crackers with whipped cream cheese. Uh, give me an idea of some of the products that you do. You do a lot of canning. We do a lot of canning. We have over 30 products. Um, it's on one side is the fruit, which is all low sugar and no sugar fruit spreads, about 18 or 19 different kinds. And then I make um, 11 kinds of relish right now. We have and also dilly beans and a few other specialty pickles. Very nice. Um, and you can you're available tomorrow at the farmers market, at which the is Coal going Garden, the Garden up market, in which Concord, has, which has a, um, over 30 vendors, everything from local beef, um, pork, chicken, um, lamb, and also there are other canners there. And then there are your winter produce vendors um, with greens and and winter produce. There's chutney. There's dog treats. It's really a, a nice atmosphere. There's always live music, and and also food is available to eat there. So it's a Good time. It's kind of like you can do your grocery shopping, but get it through all these local vendors, right? Exactly. Yeah. And Great you idea. can eat too. So <laughs> <laughs> eating helps too. Uh, really quick, I want to give the website for folks who want to interested. It's redfoxfarm.org up in Gilmington, and again, the uh, Winter's Farmers Market at Coal Garden, right? Correct. In Concord every Saturday. Every Saturday to the middle of April. And how long will these last if you purchase one of these canned items? The pickles and relishes, um, because of the vinegar base, um, they'll, they'll survive a year in your refrigerator. My low sugar fruit spreads are, uh, you need to eat them up within a month. Um, but there's, when you don't have all that sugar, it's, it's um, much more fruit in the jar, so it's better for you. And some very creative combinations. You wouldn't even have thought of this stuff. Correct. All right, I'm learning a lot of stuff here. Douglas Breed from Red Fox Farm. Thank you very much, sir. I appreciate Thanks, it. Sir. That does it for us.